Hey guys, welcome to Mafia 2. Not 3, but 2. Why are you playing 2 and not 3? Because it's better. But anyways, um, I don't know. I just wanted to play this Mafia 2. Um, haven't been on the PC. I've been on the 360 like twice. I'm like, hey, let it be a throwback game. But anyways, back at it again with another video. Let's do this. To my ma's apartment. Got it. Hi, Mama. I'm back. <laughs> Vito. Vito, my boy. <laughs> my boy is home. I thought I'd never see you again. <laughs> Francesca and me, we wait. Hey, you know, sis, what's going on? We wait for you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh. Sit down, sit down. You must be hungry, Vito. Francesca made you a special dinner. Zuppa di pollo. It's good for you. Wow, looks good, Frankie. It's a shame your papa didn't live to see this. He would be so proud, Vito. Yeah, sure. Vito, you know better. Sorry, Mama, sorry. Benedice, Signore, Pronunciata, Preparata Volontà. Sono Cirenni, Provide nel Coro Cucino di Nuova. You should get some sleep. Your room is just like you left it. Amen. It's just staring at me. <laughs> so how you two been? Franny, what have you been up to? I still live here with Mama. I got a nice office job. It pays the bills, and I started paying off some of Papa's debts. Francesca, we don't want to talk about that now. How are you, mio bambino? It must have been so terrible. I was so afraid. I prayed for you every day. I'm okay, Ma. I drove a jeep most of the time. Sometimes I had a fight. Yeah, sometimes. The heck? I just go to sleep. Going on with the rest of our day. I see you two in the morning. Sleep well, mio bambino. He's a El Balbino. Another video. This ain't gonna cut it. No, it's not. I gotta find a place to stay. Put some clothes on. Leather jacket. Something casual. Now so you have video. to go back soon. Actually, uh, looks like I won't. Uh, Joe's taking care of it for me. Joe, you want to get into trouble again? Mama, would you rather me go back and get shot again? No. Exactly. No. Joe probably saved my life. Promise that you won't get in any more trouble with that, Joe. You know. Your papa used to work for this man at the waterfront named Papa Lardo. He's in the union. You could talk to him, work hard like you were your papa. Talk to him. Please, promise me you go talk to him today. Okay, Mama, okay, I promise. Grazie, Dio. You can't be serious. Oh, go to Joe's place. Let's go see Joe. Close the door. The heck? Like I'm a freaking criminal. I don't give I'm a sorry. damn. I don't we'll care if you gotta money. sell everything you got. What the hell's going on here? Vito! You mind your business, no. asshole. Oh yeah? Yeah. <sighs> All right. Come on, Junior. What you got? What you got? What you got? School. What you got? Oh, what you got? Tough guy. Scaring a what? woman, huh? Wait, wait. Come oh, on. I gotta hold. Show me what you got. Vito, please. You like that, boy? You're making it How you like worse. that, boy? How you like that, boy? 
Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Stop, oh. stop, please. Get up. Fido, what are you doing? Get up. See the way. What the hell? Ooh, bang. Come on. Jesus, idiot lesson. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Forgot a freaking dodge. Please, Vito, this go, go again. Problem. Come on. How you like that? Again. How you like that? Get up. Get up. Get up. You'll get yourself into more trouble, Vito. Get up. Get up. Ooh. Right in the mouth. Ah, fuck. This. Yeah, that's right. Get the fuck out of here. You're going to be sorry. The both of you. What the hell was that all about? I'm sorry, Vito. We didn't want to bother you with this. Bother me? Bother me with what? Come on, tell me what's going on here, Frankie. Right before he died, Papa borrowed money. A lot of money from a loan shark. Thinking he'd get a better job and pay him back. We found out right after you left for the war. How much? Two thousand dollars. What? Shit. The worst thing is, this guy wants it all back by the end of this week. Otherwise, the debt goes up again. <sighs> I ain't gonna make that kind of money working at the port. Who is this guy? I don't know. Mama won't tell me. It's okay, Vito. We'll manage somehow. Don't worry. I'll take care of this. I promise. Thanks, Vito. Take care of yourself. <sighs> I gotta get my hands on two grand fast. I bet Joe could help me out. Hey. Excuse me, ma'am. Uh, uh, do you know where Joe Barbro lives? To the right of the stairs. And tell him that racket last night has to stop. If he don't like it, he can find another place to live. Here we go. <laughs> this is bad, huh? <laughs> We ain't getting out at all. Come on in, let's talk. Uh, you disgusting pig. I picked up these broads on my way back from the store. I've been waiting. All right, girls, that's it for now. I got business. Stop by tomorrow, okay? We'll pick up where we left off. Chop, chop. Come on, Joey. Better we have to stop when we can all have fun. The fun's over, baby. Later, I said. Me and Vito here haven't seen each other for a long time. We got a lot of catching up to do. Looks like you're doing okay, Joey boy. Not bad. I tell you, that little Spanish broad is fucking wild. So how'd it go at home? Good. Mama wasn't thrilled when I mentioned your name, though. You know how she is. She wants me to get a straight job. You're gonna look for one? I don't know, but I sure as hell ain't gonna make the same mistake my old man did. I gotta pay off his debts, then get back on my feet and get my own place. I need to make some real money, and punching the clock ain't gonna cut it. Hey, you can stay with me as long as you need to, and we'll find you a job where you can make good money without killing yourself, all right? It was it to my ears. Right now, I'm living off the 20 bucks the state gives me every week. <laughs> I know lots of people who pay well for a risky job, so to speak. I'm sure I can line something up for my oldest friend. The working man's a sucker, that's for damn sure. You said it. Okay, step one. I gotta introduce you to Giuseppe so we can pick up them discharge papers. Let's go. You got ready, man, fast. You made enough cash for all this in the last three years? Well, I like the last three months. I barely had time to furnish the place. Three months? Holy shit. You just gotta know the right people, and you're all set. Let's go. Because you know me. Let go. You thought about what you're gonna do now? What? You said you were gonna introduce me to that guy Giuseppe. No, 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 no. I meant, you know, the big picture. When you was over there, didn't you think about what you was gonna do when you got back? Hey, uh, you think I could, uh... What? Drive, Vito? The roads are icy. You ain't never drove a car before. Joe, I was driving almost the whole time I was over there. Yeah, but this ain't no tank, Vito. This is one of the nicest cars money can buy. I didn't drive a tank. I drove a Jeep. What the hell's a Jeep? Wow. It's, uh, never mind. It, you're gonna let me drive a while. All right, all right. Here's the keys. Just be fucking careful. 
All right, when it's cold as fuck outside, you gotta give it a little more gas than usual. That's the pedal over there on the right. I know, Joe, I know. <laughs> he said, what's that, G? Okay, now make a right here. Then just go straight for a while. Hey, whoa, 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 slow it down a bit. No need to get pulled over for no reason. There is cold outside. Hi. I don't want no music. Thank ya. I'll see ya. Hey, Vito, you know what time it is? It's daytime. How the fuck should I know? It's time for you to get your own fucking car. Yeah, I'd love to if I could afford one. Who says you're gonna pay for it? Wow. Wow. Baby, it's cold outside. Baby, it's cold outside. I mean, wasn't kidding. They really taught you to drive over there. At least something good come out of it. Really? Don't crash now. Don't crash. Oh, it's right here. Duh, Curry. Duh. Woohoo! Get a load of that baby. That, ooh. Nice. That's a 42 Jefferson. A 42. Beautiful what now? car like that would be ashamed to smash the window. You should grab yourself some lockpicks over at Giuseppe's. Giuseppe. Giuseppe. Welcome to Giuseppe's general store, right. a thief's paradise. You name it, he's got it. He even sells phony gun permits and discharge papers for guys tired of getting their asses shot off. Hey, Giuseppe, I brought Hello, you a new customer. He's uh, straight up, right? Yes, sir, all the way. This here's Vito, my oldest friend. This is Giuseppe, the best safe cracker <laughs> in Empire Retired, Bay. please. How are you? The papers for you? Yeah, they are. You got them finished already? It was a pain in the ass, but sure, they're done. Well, thanks. This really gonna work? Nobody from the army would bother you again, trust me. You see? what I tell you? Here's the money. Take your papers, Vito. Uh, we need a set of lockpicks, too. That we do. And guess who's paying for them? <laughs> Grazie. But you can test it right now. Here, take this lock. You just need to insert the pick into the lock and lift all the pins. You use the wrench to hold the pins one by one. When all of the pins are set, just turn the wrench and the lock show it's easy. Wait, what do I press? Oh. Bada boom. See you around, Giuseppe. Say Benadi. Easy, huh? Don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. I do it all the time when I lock my keys in the car. Huh? Okay. Right. You still feel like snagging that car? You kidding me? Absolutely. Well, here's your chance. All right, let's take it. Hold. Okay. I gotta hold the whole time. Yep. Right, let's do this. Bada boom. Bada beam. How it seems. But um, I'm kind of getting a chase here. Bada popos. Bada. Bada popos. Bada. Bada popos. Okay, we're good. Look who's hey, here. Hey, Mikey boy, what's going on? Shit, Mike, you can wash your fucking hands once in a while. Now I need a fucking bed. Hey, I've been working. Working people occasionally get dirty, you know. Besides, I just wiped them off. With what? The same fucking rag you used to clean the toilet, you filthy fuck? Put a lid on it. What, what are you, from the health department, or you want to do some business? <laughs> business, of course. This here's my friend Vito. Vito, this is Mike Bruski, but don't shake his hand. I ain't got that much soap at home. Nice to meet you, Vito. Hey, uh, me and Vito go way back. He just come back from overseas and he needs some cash. So I figure he can help with your uh, supply problem. I can vouch for him. Uh-huh. Okay. Joe told you about our side business, right? Yeah. I only want regular cars, nothing fancy. You get a cut of every car. I take as many as I can handle. And don't bring no cops around, okay? They follow you here. I don't know your ass from Jesus. You get me? Got it. God damn it, Mike. You put your grubby mitts on my fucking coat. I paid a fortune for this thing. 
All right, calm down or I'll stick them up your ass, you sissy. You know, dry cleaning costs Jesus these days Christ. plenty, and who knows if they can even get this filled out. You shut up. Rita, listen to me. I need a Walter Coop today. I got a few people looking for parts, but I can't find a car. Because you don't know where to look. Every time I drive down Hunters, I see one parked by a bar there. I think the place is called the Lone Star. Isn't that a mole in your neighborhood? I'll stick out like a sore thumb. All right, look, I'll give you 350 bucks for it. It's worth the risk, right? 400. <laughs> All right, deal. Avito, come on, let's go. Andiamo. Meantime, I'll be sending you the cleaning bill for my coat. Yeah, I'll change my address, you rat prick. Okay, listen up. This is your maiden voyage, so to speak. So try not to fuck it up, eh? Here, Vito, take this. Just in case. Hey, nice. Hey, Mike, you mind if I test this thing out here? Sure. Knock yourself out. Here you go. Aim for that old wreck over there. All right, let's hope. Damn, what am I doing? Five. Okay. Now what? Oh, shoot the tires. Hey, you ain't a bad shot. Hey, Vito, see if you can hit the gas tank. <gasps> wow. Shit. Can I leave gas in that thing? There's a Pollock joke there, but I'll leave it alone. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Fuck you. All right, huh? that's enough shooting. We got work to do. Let's go. Drive to the long whatever bar with Joe. Can you stop playing the music? I don't want to get copyrighted. Bing. It's that cream colored baby over there. Be careful. Do it quick and get the fuck out of there. Break a window if you have to and go. I'll wait for your back at Mike's. What if I run into problems? Then you deal with them. Look, consider this a test. If you fail, I hear the hiring down at the factory. Right, just asking. Good luck, pal. I see you back at Mike's. So he just leaves me. Hey, what the fuck are you doing over there? Ah, oh, shit. Hey, what you doing, motherfucker? <gasps> wow. I see you. Come on. Headshot. There you go. Headshot. The hell's a twin? <gasps> right, come on. Oh man, what is going on? All right, can I like um steal him now? Or no? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Use wrench. Ah, damn it. Oh, I didn't see that. One. That's easy. Let's get out of here. Oh, let's go! Oh crap! Oh crap! Sticks! Oh crap! A labor dabs, badass bips. I'm out of here. I'm out of here like swimwear. Let go! Keep on with this music. No, what are you doing? Throw the on my ass. Exactly. Bruh. I think I'm going the long way if I do that, right? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, nah, let me keep going. I'm losing them, I'm losing them. Skimmy! Oh, this thing is slow. <sighs> Fast forward.
Got it. Hey, hey, mission accomplished. How'd it go? Yeah, piece of cake. Except for the fact that the car belonged to a bunch of moolies who immediately tried to kill me right after you left. Ah, uh, probably the bombers. Hunters their neighborhood. Guys like that, you don't have to worry about them. I just hang out on the street, talk shit, steal shit, and smoke dope. <sighs> Let's see what we got here. Mmm, nice. No stains. Clean. The lowlife get the money for this. Probably stole it himself. It's nice, though. How much did I say I'd give you for it again? 600. <laughs> oh, I like you, buddy, Joe. Here's your 400 bucks. Stop by again, okay? We can do some more business. Yeah, you bet, Mike. I see you, Mike. I'll stop by again real soon. All Me right, too. boys. I'll see you later. Here's your 300 bananas. I'm taking my cut as the middleman. Next time, you're on your own. All right. Thanks, Joe. All right, let's go home. I'm exhausted. All right, basically we're just going back. So, I'm going to end it right here. Yeah. But anyways, thank you everybody for watching. Watch me play some Mafia too. Some throwback. It's your boy, Iceman. And I will see you in my next video. Peace.